that's the result. Lauren's going to pick us all up and take away. Ian's in a terrible old state, isn't he? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's a tough time. Well, well, come on, tell us about this exam. I said I failed, all right? Well, you've probably done better than you think. That's what I said. Look, I said I failed. Why don't either of you two get that? All right, we get it. Even if you have abs, it ain't the end of the world, is it? It is to me. You know, some parents actually came to the school to meet their kids, but I suppose that was too much to ask. Sorry, did you not see Ian Bill sitting there? The bloke is burying his daughter tomorrow. Yeah, that was quite the performance. Well, what do you, what do you want me to do? What, chuck him out? Like, you care about Ian Beale? Perhaps his daughter has been murdered, all right? She weren't much older than Laura. Yeah, that didn't stop you sleeping with her, did it? Yes? Mrs. Dorothy Branning? Yes? I'm afraid we have some bad news. It concerns your son, Nicholas Cotton. You'd better come in. What's he done this time? It's not that, Mrs. Branning. I'm very sorry to tell you that your son has died. So what are you going to say to Sharon? Me? Hey. And give her the satisfaction. Well, how are you going to stop it? I'm not. You and Sal are. What are you talking about? Look, there's two tickets there. You've got to do whatever it is you have to do. Peggy, I, I can't go back there. Uh, you'll do as you're told. And you give her a message from me. You tell that bitch that hell will freeze over before she becomes a Mitchell again. I know you're here, Nick. You ain't gonna scare me tonight.
Hello, Ma. Hello, Ma. Hello, Ma. Happy Halloween. Oh, here she is. I might think of a few things to say about you and all. Me, I want a word with you outside. Not now. It's important. Well, spit it out. Please, Mick, outside. You stay right here. Oh, right. Because you don't want him to hear what I've got to say. You want to keep him close. Oh, it's Dean. That's just in time for coffee. You need to tell him the truth. Stay outside! Death. Mick. She said Mick, stay she's out. she's lying to you! She's lying to you. Look at me. Look at me. She's been lying you to disgust you. Disgust me. Mick, no! Get Mick. up. Get up. Mick, no! Stop it, man! No! Dean is your brother. Dad, Dad, what is it? What is it? Why can't you just tell me? Dad, what? Don't. No, just what is it? What is it? It's Lucy. Don't say it. Please don't say it. She's gone! She's gone. Oh, I'm sorry, please. She's gone. Funny, Shirley. No. You haven't heard the punchline yet. So what? Well, you're gonna throw the rest of your life away, eh? You just got Dean back, you got your old family and a Vic. You're gonna bin all that, I No, you binned it when you bin me! Please. Please, Shirley, just put it down. This is a joke, Shirley, because it's over, all right? We got a wedding reception to get back to that the old square turned out for. So what, Shirley? She ain't gonna do it. It's a bottle merchant. All talk. Now, Sharon, she gets things done. She wants a bar, she gets a bar. She wants me, she gets me. What have you got? I've got a gun, Phil! Yeah, 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 whatever. And when I get home, I want you gone. You'll come running back. Come on. No. No, she's right, you will go running back. I want this sorted now. So do I. Shirley! No! Please leave a message. Lucy, are you coming back tonight? I know I messed up. Please don't be mad. Just text me. Hi, this is Lucy. Please leave a message. Lucy, it's Lee. You're not coming to this party? I fancy another cheesecake breakfast. <laughs> that only message. Anyway, I hope you sort stuff out with your dad. Yeah? This is Lucy. Please leave a message. Lucy, it's, uh, it's me, it's Dad. Um, I'm... I'm sorry.